A Tampa Bay woman is taking on the largest pharmacy chain in America after years of what she calls discrimination against people with chronic pain. Eight on your side's Marco Villarreal is live in Tampa with more on this story. Tell us about this, Marco. Well, good morning, Avery. I'll tell you what this woman says that no matter which CVS she went to, they would not fill her prescription of opioid pain medicine. And surviving stage one breast cancer was only the beginning of a health nightmare for Edith Fugue. Since then, she has suffered through MRSA, sepsis, lupus, Guillain Barre syndrome, and now lives with severe chronic pain. In a 31 page class action complaint, Edith says her CVS pharmacist in 2017 told her they would no longer fill her opioid prescription medicine. Edith and her attorney believe that the fight to stop opioid abuse has led to discrimination against people who really need their medication. But the way the system is set up now, it's impossible for anyone to abuse the medications because the doctors and the pharmacies are all linked together. Edith is now taking her fight to court, calling the actions of CVS Pharmacy discrimination and violations of several acts, including the Americans with Disabilities Act. I have reached out to CVS Pharmacy several times and have yet to hear back from them. And coming up on News Channel 8 today at 6.30, I'm going to show you how Edith continues to hang on to hope. For now, reporting live in Tampa, Marco Villarreal, 8 on your side.